Ah, uh, look at that. She's a Beautiful. professional. <laughs> Thanks, hon. <laughs> so, it's been 20 years since the captain. Yeah. How does it feel looking back on that? It's really surreal, actually. It's, it's just weird because I think back of the first time that I played this festival as me on my own. I came here 21 years ago and I played um, as a backup singer in Buddy Miller's band, which was really amazing and special. And that is where I got the gig the next year, my own gig, and I was so excited. So I played all of these songs that I'd never really played to audiences before, and they were all songs that were on the Captain album. So it was a really special time for me. I didn't know that it was, you know, going to become this thing, you know, this this time in my life that was so special to me, and I didn't even really know that the Captain was going to take on a whole life of its own, you know. So now looking back, um, it's just it's just been such a special journey and I have played here so many times since. I'm really lucky that I've I've been able to well I've been here every year since out in the audience if I'm not on stage. Um, and I just love it. It's just such a special time and I um, I feel like it's such a beautiful family to be a part of. Um, the artists, but also like the people that come back every year, you know, and they're up the front and they you know, they just love music and everyone is here for the right reason. It's just a beautiful thing to be a part of. I feel really lucky. What's your favourite Blues Best memory? Oh, that's massive. That's so big. Um, Okay, I uh, look to be really honest with you. I think one of my favourite Blues Fest memories is actually playing that first year as as Casey Chambers playing all the songs off the Captain. I did not know that um, it was going to be as special as it was, and, and but I could kind of feel it at the time, going, "Wow." There's something going on here. There's, there's this connection between me and this festival that I just don't know that I've ever really felt it with anything else before. It, it's really been a part of my life and um, not, not just a part of my musical life. You know, I've had times in my life too where I have gotten away from music and I have um, lost my connection a little bit with music and then I come back and I come to Blues Fest and it brings it all back for me you know so it's been like this fest was like therapy for us as well you know it's really 100% it's, it's, this is never just a gig never ever just a gig it's always really special beautiful I'm going to let you go because I know you're very busy oh, so I could talk I all day guess. I could talk ah. all day but, yeah, <laughs> yeah that's <laughs> Love on every occasion Love, love, love Love, love, love We're gonna love like there's no two Love like there's no two More We've only got one more song. We're running out of time. But stay and jam with us. Thank you so much. Please thank this band. Sorry, we're running over time. Brandon Dodd here. Jeff McCormack. BJ Barker. My dad, Bill Chambers. Thanks on the sound, Petey. And all the gang back here. The Veronicas, Ben Harper. The war and treaty, these beautiful people. Go see them tomorrow. Thanks for having us. Happy 20 years of the captain.
Fest is celebrating our 30th anniversary. We all know that. We're having a bit of a party back here. And I think you'll agree, Casey's just given us the best party we've ever had. But she doesn't get away with it that easily because Casey has been to the last 21 Blues Fest. And it was 20 years ago that she played the captain on the Blues Fest field for the first time. And we all know about the beautiful Aria Award and the, all the awards that Casey's won. And this isn't going to be the biggest, but it's going to be the one given with the most love from Peter Noble to Casey. Hey, hey y'all, you know what happened today? 
Casey came around and sang Happy Birthday Blues Fest to me. Just to me. That's, and you know what? That's because if you know this person, you know that she is the most beautiful, wonderful, genuine people you're ever going to meet. You made, you made me cry today. I'm going to do my best to make you cry. And yes, I rem and I've got to say this on this stage tonight. I remember, Casey, you coming and, and you played your first Blues Fest on one of them smaller stages and your mum was at the back of the stage and you know what she said to me? Thank you for booking my daughter. And I went, Di, are you out there? Di, where are you? Anyway, and I, was, and I went, oh yeah, oh yeah. And she said, no, really, thank you. Thank you for giving her a shot. And I went, giving her a shot? The next year, the captain comes out and she's playing the main stage. And 20 years later, she's still playing it. And you know what? In Australia, this is one of the greatest artists we've ever produced. Ever, ever. We want to give you a little thing to say thank you to put under your Hall of Fame, Casey Chambers. So proud of you, so proud of you. Thank you so much. Sorry, that's so special. This is such a special festival to me and I really don't know what to say. I'm never lost for words. But I just, in the words of my my greatest musical influence of all time, my dad, just don't be a dickhead. <laughs> <laughs>